Oh, hi, you're back. <laughs> Are you ready for show and tell? Are you ready to see what shit I got last week? On the, on the fucking ride along? Fucking let's do some show and tell. Let's fucking do it. So we went to the markets nice and early. It was uh, 5.30 we left in the morning. Went to the markets pretty early on a Sunday. And um, first thing I got for a dollar was uh, these classic Ninja Turtle skateboard. Little mini skateboards, pretty fucking sweet. I will not be upset if they don't sell. I won't be upset if they don't sell because I'll keep them for my Ninja Turtle collection because I'm a Ninja Turtle collector. So, none. There's none listed. There is none at all listed of these. So, I'm gonna put 20 bucks on these. Uh, we'll see if they sell. Probably more likely ten dollars, but uh, for a dollar I'm going to put them up for twenty bucks to start off with because um, I kind of don't want them to sell. I kind of don't want them to sell. So twenty bucks, twenty bucks for the kitty. And just remember, all the uh, prices that I give are undercutting other people on the uh, on the eBay, and this is before fees, before fees, and before taxes. All right, so I got all these Snoopy toys. Now, funny enough, I was just watching a couple of weeks. Um, what uh, Happy Meal and Kids Meals um, sell the best on uh, YouTube. That's why it's always good to um, don't think you're the fucking greatest and the best and you want to be the only YouTube channel on there and not watch and subscribe to anyone else. Subscribe to other people's channels and um, they will give you information about toys, clothes um, and all that, all that shit. Um, there's some great Australian uh, there's great Australian content out there which hard to find so unless you know what you're looking for uh, two Aussie thrifters please look that up they are the best on Australian YouTube look my mum hustling as well all the other ones I know you get pissed because I don't mention you but uh, th those two um, I watch those two channels and they give me heaps of advice Some, so much different to what I do and buy but Knowledge. Knowledge is power and share knowledge with each other. Anyway, all these Snoopy toys. All these Snoopy toys. They're 50 cents each. She only charged me $3 though for the seven of them. So I got one for free. And we got uh, uh, Snoopy New Zealand. Uh, Snoopy, is that Holland? Probably Holland. We'll say Holland. Um, Fiji and uh, Ireland. Fucking got a pot of gold there. All that. Anyway, all these Snoopies, um, as a lot, I should get, I should, and they should sell, I should get 20 bucks for them. If you can get the whole set of 22 of these uh, Snoopies, you're looking at, um, you're looking at about uh, 100 bucks or more if you've got the whole set um, and still in the plastic wrappers. So keep an eye out for Snoopy toys. Um, these are McDonald's meals um, and... Uh, Definitely. I don't know why they're worth so much and why people want them, but, uh, but there's 20 bucks for the kitty. Next, I found uh, this Simpsons 15th season. All the discs were in there. I paid $2 for this one. Um, unfortunately, the most I can probably get for it is about, and it's, it's a bit too heavy to put as a $2 uh, postage um, as a DVD, so many discs. So, most I can really get because everyone's selling it for $10. So, um, I'm not going to sell this. This is not going in the kitty unfortunately, but um, I'm going to save any uh, Simpsons uh, box sets that I get for a dollar and two dollars and we're going to lot them all up. Once you've got about ten of them, you will get, uh, someone will buy them bulk uh, for a hundred bucks. Look that up on eBay and type in the Simpsons DVDs lot or bulk and you'll see um, how much people are paying for them and if you can get them for a couple of bucks each, you're going to make some good money. So we'll save that one for when we accumulate more. So that's pretty good. So that's just going to go... Oh, nah. Okay, I found these two Wii games. Um, they were a dollar each. I thought I was uh, pretty damn smart by uh, getting these for a dollar and thinking that I was going to get some good money because one's Sonic and one's Mickey. Um, I'm not going to throw these over my shoulder like I usually do with shit that's not worth any money uh, because I'm going to either, either lock them up with a whole heap of Wii games, so if you lot them up with a whole heap of Wii games, 
you'll get um, some good money back. Um, or I might give them away uh, to uh, a mate of mine whose uh, kid has a Wii and uh, they like playing games, so I might do that. But one of them was Sonic and one of them was Mickey. They go for about eight bucks each, um, but people had them eight dollars with free postage. Um, so really in the end it's about five dollars before your fees and all that. Not worth it, not, not worth my time, not worth, not worth it. I'd rather get kicked in the dick. Uh, then fucking make five dollars and waste my time going backwards and forwards. Kick me in the dick now and give me five dollars instead of me selling these and going to the post office and wasting my time. I'd rather just sit here and get a kick in the dick. Kick in the dick. So I'll give those away. I will give those away. I didn't get too much from this markets, but you know, there's still more. There's still more. Don't tune out yet. Don't tune out. So I've got these two antennas. I was really happy with this as well. I was excited. I was so excited. These two antennas. Uh, these antennas, HD TV antennas, are 30 mile range and they give you 1080 uh, uh, HD TV output. These are sealed. Um, antennas is a sealed. There's none on there that are listed of these ones. There's other cheap random brands, but all these other cheap random brands, they're selling for six dollars. They're selling for six bucks with free postage. I'm not 100% sure what to do uh, with this situation um, because I thought these might have been worth 20 bucks each, which I still honestly do think they will be. So I'm not putting them in the kitty at the moment. I'm going to keep researching these. I paid two dollars each for them. Um, these are good if you've got a big backyard and what if you put your big TV out in the middle of the big backyard for grand final day and um, you want everyone to fucking sink piss and watch the footy game on your uh, uh, back lawn instead of your house getting dirty and uh, and you need an aerial but the aerial cord won't uh, reach and everyone's tripping over it and they're oh fuck I've tripped over the fucking cord and now the game is off one of the guys is, you're a fucking dickhead. Where you fucking, I just missed a goal. Then someone else is like, fucking, I don't know if you got any possessions now because you fucking made the aerial come out, you fucking dumb cock smoker. And then you miss fucking 30 seconds of the game. And So, if you, there's my eBay store down the bottom there. If you wanted to buy these, just send us a message. Or there's my Instagram. Uh, you can also Instagram me and uh, tell me to put them up onto eBay and list them if you're interested, so just uh, give me a message because I don't know. So give me a message on Instagram uh, if you think I should sell them, because that's a good scenario. Imagine if you did want to put the TV out in the middle of the backyard and you don't have a long enough antenna, it's pretty damn good, and they're a good brand, but they don't go in the kitty. So I got for $5 an original pressing, an original pressing of The Godfather. The Godfather... Uh soundtrack on vinyl now it's got a few light scratches on it but it's not bad so uh, you know the old Marlon Brando golf other now brand new ones now new I'm talking new new ones with different covers to this with the actual like uh, original theater poster go for fifty dollars brand new and, and they've been selling they have been selling um, People have got the original ones that are selling for twenty to thirty dollars, but different cover to this. No one has this cover. And this is actual from the motion picture. So I'm going to put mine up, and I found it. At, I'll be happy to get thirty bucks for it, but I'm going to put mine up at fifty dollars because I'm the only one on eBay with this. I've got a feeling that it will probably sell straight away. It will be in the death pile for a few weeks. But, no, you know what, I'm going to, I'm not going to have a death pile anymore. I'm not going to fucking let that happen again. I'm not going to let that happen again. That was a lot of work. So, I'm going to, I'm going to put this up. Uh, 50 bucks for the kitty. 50 bucks for the kitty. Alrighty, let's keep on cruising. Don't forget, Tuesdays we have, come ride with me, ride along, whatever the fuck you want to call it. So, don't miss, ooh, Iron Jamisons. I picked up this uh, Star Wars Omni... Oh, om, omni... Blah, omni... Fucking time. Fuck up. Fuck up. Omnius... Om... Omnia... 
Om Nibia. I got Star Wars. Um, it's got all three movies on it. Um, I can get ten to fifteen dollars for this book actually. Uh, it was fifty cents. This is not going in the kitty. Another one that's not going in the kitty, unfortunately. That is going on my shelf with all my Star Wars books, and I will read that whenever I get a chance to read it. So before I moved on to the next markets, this was the last item from the main markets. If you've never been to the Melville markets on a Sunday, um, Melville, it's on Canning Highway, uh, Western Australia, Sunday mornings, best markets ever. So good. I've sold there twice. Once I got 500 bucks. Second time, it was about between three and four hundred dollars, um, and that was just selling leftover junk that wasn't selling for me. Uh, very good place to sell. A lot of people go there to buy shit, um, and you get stuff cheap. It's awesome. So that's Melville Market. So the junkie sold me this, and I checked it. I said on the last video I hadn't checked to see if all the discs were in there. All the discs are in there. Everything is complete. We have the Sopranos box set with every fucking season and all the extras uh, I paid five dollars he wanted ten dollars but he can get fucked I gave him five dollars oh man when I looked up the returns for this so this Soprano series has been selling between a hundred and a hundred and fifty dollars the hundred and fifty dollars is more of the new the hundred dollar mark in between a hundred and hundred and fifty is the used most people just have the single discs for sale or the the, the seasons so not many people have this on there for sale. It's pretty damn heavy too. But uh, it's awesome that the uh, satchel bags from Australia Post now can go up to five kilos, whatever size. So that's pretty fucking sweet. So this will only this will fit in a $12.55 one, I think. Or it might be a $15 one. I think it's a $15 one once I put bubble wrap around it. Um, don't think it's more than five kilos. That's not more than five kilos. I'm going to weigh this. Just under two kilos. Just under two kilos. All right. So I reckon I'll I, I'm going to start it at $150, and then we'll see if we get watches and all that, and then I'll send them offers. But I'm going to bank on $100 for this. So I'll start it at $150, but we're only going to put 100 bucks in the kitty for this one. From $5. Woo! Kitty going like that. Kitty going to like that. I actually might watch it while it's. While it's listed and uh, not sold, I might uh, start watching it. Or is it on Netflix and stand now? I'm not sure. Oh, and there's shit on there. I've got to wipe this down properly. It's fucking gross. So that first market, I spent $22.50. Um, there was a lot of stuff like the Wii game, the Simpsons, which would be lotted up, and the aerials and all that. So there was uh, five items that um, were worth nothing at the moment. So a return of $135, it's okay. Um, not um, really worth getting up for 5, 5 o'clock, 5.30 to go to the markets for. Yeah, fucking know if it is. I fucking like the markets because you never know what you're going to find. You can find some good shit. So then I went to the uh, Cadinia markets, which is around the corner on the way home. Um, this market is pretty shit. Usually crap. Don't ever go to that markets first always go to the Melville markets first this one's just your little follow-up one that to see if you can get some uh, extra crap for yourself and see if you can find some gems and I found a couple I found a couple whoa 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 back it up back it fucking up I fucking forgot one I fucking forgot one always always so I actually spent $27.50 at uh, the Melville Markets because I got this for $5, an unopened Sherlock puzzle game. This puzzle game was $5. I thought, I'm going to get it because it's in a nice, beautiful wooden box, unopened wooden puzzle game. So I looked it up. These go between $40 to $80. They sell for $40 to $80 and they sell. The puzzle game sell. Now, I did some research on my one. My one, I'm looking like I'm going to undercut people. I'm going to put mine on for $50. It's a bit heavy as well. $50. Bucks. Um, I'll be happy with $30. I'll take first uh, offer. And um, that's pretty fucking cool. I actually want to play it, but what's the point? I'd rather the money, so I've got uh, 
more drinking money uh, for my honeymoon to do whatever the fuck I want. So that's pretty fucking sweet. So that really takes it up to $185 for uh, the first the first market. So then we move on to the second market. Let's go to Kadinya now. Kadinya Park. Alright, I found... We got a video. We've got a video. If you ever see these, buy it straight away. Buy it straight away. And if there's too much competition on the internet, hold on to it until there's not many on there. This is a JVC video where you put you put the remember when the video cameras had the small video inside it had the small video inside it and you put that in there you put it in there you go meow and you put it in the VHS and that's how you watched everything that you captured on your video camera back in the day it wasn't all like this so that there my friends I paid five dollars Five fucking bucks. She wanted ten. And I said, no, no, no. No, 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 no. And I gave her a fiver. Five bucks for that. We will get, we will get, at the least, we will get fifty dollars for this. Fifty bucks. It's just like a few weeks ago or a week ago, whenever the fuck it was, when I found that JVC battery for a video camera that goes with the tapes like this. Good money. You got to look out for that stuff. Get get some knowledge into you. Get uh, get learning. Get learning about all this stuff. So fifty bucks, and um, I'm not going to sell this straight away. I'm going to hold on to it because uh, my dad has some uh, old. Um, he's been asking me to try and find one of these for him. Um, he's not having it and want fifty bucks for it. He can give me fifty bucks for it. Now nah, he's gonna give me the tapes from uh, when I was a kid, and we're gonna record them to uh, digital format. And then once we've done all the home family videos, then I'll uh, sell this off, and we'll get fifty bucks for it. But this won't go online for a while. I want to um, want to use this for first, but definitely putting fifty dollars into the kitty for it because I will sell this eventually. Just got to use it first, but um, it's fucking cool. I'm just gonna wipe this next one down before I show it because. Uh, it's a bit fucking filthy and I don't even want to, yeah. See how fucking dirty that was? Yuck. So this next one, this old guy, he had a Dockers picture, if you do remember. He had a Dockers 1995 picture, but it was very water damaged, so I didn't get that. I would have kept that for myself, because um, it was pretty cool. We wanted $15 for that and for this East Fremantle Sharks waffle uh, team of the century. Um, if you don't know, if you're from Victoria or if you're from New South Wales and all that, the waffle is the uh, like the seconds team. It's like uh, uh, like your VFL and uh, whatever you have in New South Wales and Queensland and all that, and uh, Adelaide is uh, SNFL, whatever it's called. So, um, so anyway, East Fremantle Sharks. They've been around for a long, long time. Let's have a look at this. You know what? I'm gonna do this instead. Look at that. Isn't that lovely? Now the picture has come kind of offside, but that's the East Fremantle Sharks logo there. One of the best football teams in Western Australia with their record. I don't personally go for them, but they're a damn good club. And it's a Hall of Fame team. There's all their premierships that they've had there. Last one when this was made is 98. I'm pretty sure they've won one since. Pretty sure they've won one since. I'm not sure. Uh, but anyway, that's pretty cool. I didn't know she fucking played for them. But uh, anyway, fucking, um, she might have been a full back. Yeah, she looks like she would have. Yeah, yeah. They look like they both would have played full back. Definitely. I'm just mucking around. Alright, so that's pretty sweet. So I got that for $10. I'll sell this locally. I'll sell this locally, and I'm. I. I really do think I'll get a hundred bucks for this. I. I personally think I'll get a hundred bucks for this. But what we're gonna say for the kitty, we're gonna say we'll get fifty. We'll say we'll get fifty. I think we'll get a hundred, but I'm gonna say for the kitty, we'll get fifty. That's really fucking nice, isn't it? I'm a Peel Thunder fan. Don't get me wrong. I'm a Peel Thunder fan. I'm not jumping shit. Oh shit. Right there, there's going to be a shark supporter that wants that. I really do think it's going to be 100. Actually, you know what? I'm putting 100 in the kitty. 
I think I'm gonna get. No, I'm putting 50 in the kitty. I'm not gonna get greedy. I'm not gonna get greedy. I'll, I'll, I'll take 50 for it because I'm. I'll take 50 for it. I'll put it for 100, but I'll take 50 for it because a real sharks fan will want that, and I think they should have that. I think they should have that. You know what? I like it because I wouldn't want to get ripped off if I found a peel thunder one that I wanted. So. Someone just trying to make some extra, extra, extra money. So I'm going to be nice on this one. I'm going to put Kitty fifty dollars. Even though I'm going to try and sell it for a hundred, but I think I'll take fifty. Might even take less, but I could probably get some good money for that. All right, it's time to bring up the Kitty. 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 We spent forty-two dollars at the markets. We got up at five thirty in the morning. And spend forty-two dollars. Kitty, put it up, kitty. Is that it? Kitty, is that it? Kitty doesn't lie. And because I'm gonna be nice with the the frame picture, kitty, come on. Kitty doesn't lie. Two hundred eighty-five dollars. Bad kitty. Bad fucking kitty. Naughty kitty. Naughty kitty. You're a fucking little prick, kitty. You're a fucking little prick. 285. Got up early for that. And I didn't even get any toys. I got one video. Oh, I got those Ninja Turtle uh, skateboards that I'm hoping doesn't sell so I can keep them for my Ninja Turtle collection. Um, hoping they don't sell because I've got too much Ninja Turtle stuff already. Sweet guys, uh, you know, I know you get on the Instagram if you want to person, personally message me. Uh, there's my eBay account again. Don't forget, don't forget ride alongs on Tuesday. Woo! Ride alongs, where we're going to go next, I don't know, but let me tell you this if I can get over 50 likes for this video, 50 likes for this video, next week. And the whole of December, the whole of December, if I get over 50 likes for this, the whole of December, I, for show and tell, will dress up as Santa Claus. For the whole of December, I will do show and tell as Santa Claus. Evil Santa, mind you. 50 likes. 50 likes. Alright guys, fucking, I actually really do appreciate it. Let's get those fucking, let's get those subscribers up and cranking. Fucking like, share, subscribe, no oh, fuck, whatever. Do what the fuck you want. But I'll be back Tuesday for Ride Along. And if there's more than 50 likes for this video, someone's gonna be Santa next show and tell the whole of December. And I'll be ho ho hoing. I'll be ho ho hoing. See you guys, see you.